Hi y'all, it is a random Wednesday in the middle of a random week, but I wanted to start a vlog, so here we are. I just went thrifting and scored big time. I found one thing, but oh my God, I'm obsessed. It's a black turtleneck from Gap, and I put it on and it just fits perfectly. I'll show you in a sec. Okay, here it is. It's actually perfect. Honestly, the first thing I thought of when I put it on was that Emma Chamberlain video. I think it's titled The Black Turtleneck, A Closet Staple or something like that. I feel like this is the exact turtleneck that she was talking about. It doesn't fold over on the neck, so it's perfect for necklaces. And it also just like doesn't look bulky. It's tight fitted. It's stretchy. The sleeves are a perfect length. It can be long or you can tuck it in and make it short. I'm just so obsessed with it. I'm so happy that I found this. I already went to work today, so I'm like done with my main item of the day, but I still have a few things to do. I need to make my bed first of all, because I never did that this morning. And I always like to make my bed because it just makes me feel more productive and it makes my room just feel better to live in. So that needs to happen. And I need to respond to an email. I need to do some other work stuff and I need to do a load of laundry, mainly just because I might wanna wear that turtleneck tomorrow and I just like wanna have it ready. Oh, I also need to wash dishes. I just took a little nap. Yes, I took a nap in jeans. I do it often, actually. I know it's like, I don't know. People don't do that, but I do. I've been so tired lately because there's this train that goes kind of by my school. And for the past couple days, it's been coming by at like 6.30 a.m., which wakes me up really early, but also in the middle of the night. So I'm being woken up multiple times by a train and it's just not ideal, but that nap was really good but I didn't finish everything from my to-do list earlier, so I'm gonna finish some of those things. It's the next day and I'm wearing the turtleneck. I picked the perfect day to wear it too. It's about to rain. It's not cold, but it's just like a little bit breezy and just like perfect. I've got my boots on and I've been carrying around this tote bag. I feel so chic with my floating head and my tote bag. I feel like I'm channeling an 80s receptionist. It's much later. I went to work because I worked extra today. We had some like extra projects. I'm eating honeydew. A lot of people are honeydew haters. Honestly, I don't get it. I've been loving honeydew since I was little. Today, I really need to finish watching a movie. I started watching Anatomy of a Fall like three weeks ago and I got like 30 minutes into it because this movie is like two and a half hours long, I think. And it's just, uh, like, it's objectively a good movie, but it's just really hard for me to, like, press play. And I'm also canceling my Hulu subscription tomorrow. So I really only have today and, like, tomorrow morning to finish this movie if I want to finish it. And I do want to finish it, so I need to work on that tonight. I need to respond to another email. I'm such a working girly. I'm going to make an emergency to sip on while I watch Anatomy of a Fall. Not because I'm getting sick, but just because... I want something to sip on and also just to be preventative. I feel like I haven't been getting a lot of vitamin C lately. And also when I get sick, I get really sick and it lasts for like way longer than it should and it's debilitating. So I need to get on top of it before school starts again. Plus, I just want a fun drink to drink during a movie, obviously. What do y'all think of my movie fit? Be honest. I thrifted this shirt for probably like a dollar in Florida. Pants are from Target. Hi, happy Wednesday. Jade's coming over later, which is super fun and exciting. She's staying with me for the night because she's moving into her room tomorrow morning and she lives far away. So she's just like hanging here for the night. Also, it is so hot. Yesterday, it was so hot and humid that the windows in our student union building were fogging up. The sidewalks were wet and it didn't even rain and there was like a puddle of moisture on the bathroom floor. It, it was riddick. It's a little bit better today, but it's still just like, I don't know. My room is just like hot, but I need to start getting my stuff off of Abby's side of the room. I have stuff all over her desk and her bed and I've just been putting off cleaning because I don't know, it's just like, it's so simple, but for some reason it's just like, 
I just can't do it. I think the fact that I have a friend coming over to spend the night is helping me because she does need a bed to sleep on and I need to clean stuff off of the bed. I'm gonna watch my queen, Audrey Atienza, while I clean my room. Backstory for this poster. <laughs> for context, I'm in the St. Olaf Choir and here just like, we just call it Oli Choir for short because at St. Olaf we're the Olies. And this guy in choir last year, his parents got him a custom license plate that said this. And me and my roommate just thought it was the funniest thing. Oli Kerr was actually the name of our choir group chat last year. Like it was an ongoing meme basically. So we just thought it was hilarious and made this for our choir's little broom ball team. And we went to a game and brought this to the choir broom ball game and then we hung it on our door for the rest of the year. So this is probably gonna go on the door again. Okay, all the rest of this is Abby's stuff that I was keeping for her over the summer. So I did it, y'all. Jade's here. Hey! We're going to Target. Do you guys see how packed my car is? <laughs> Can you tell them what just happened? What? The girl, the freshman girl. <laughs> oh, I met a fan! <laughs> thing it was so no, freaking was cute, so cute. I, I don't want to call her a fan she's a subscriber <laughs> she said she hasn't subscribed yet but oh, she okay. will she was so did we, nice did we even ask her name no i didn't ask what her name was but she was so sweet and if you're seeing this thank you that literally made my entire day you're the sweetest and i hope you have a beautiful school year yes <laughs> i hope she's my sore kid what else do we need to talk about I move in tomorrow, so I have to move all this in tomorrow, so now I'm just <laughs> sitting in my car, and I didn't, okay, I had so much stuff, I had to leave some stuff at home, and I had boxes and bags where Rachel is currently sitting, so I had to rearrange my car and then go put bags in her room. Yeah. So Rachel could fit in my car, so we go yeah. to Target. She's like stressed that she has too much stuff in the car, but I said I think this is a normal amount. It's just kind of funny that we had to move stuff so that I could sit in the car. <laughs> We're gonna go to Target. She wants to get treats for her roommate. I got her a little bracelet from Turkey. <laughs> Rachel was joking that I was gonna be insufferable about how I went to Turkey this summer and did archeology span for a month. And I think that's okay. I think you have like a three month period of time where it's okay to be a little insufferable about it. <laughs> no, I feel like every time I talk about it, I'm so annoying already. Like I've stopped talking about it at home. Well, I didn't talk about it unless people asked me, but people are asking me all the time. I know that girl, she's friends with Patrick. Patrick also went to Turkey. <laughs> We know everybody. Okay, a slight con, but maybe also a pro of going to a small school is that you know everybody. Yeah. And even if you don't know them, you know of them and like you know things about them. Or you follow them on Instagram. Yeah. So think about that. But I kind of <laughs> love it. As long as you stay unproblematic and you don't make any ops, it can be fun. I agree. We walk in a Target and what's the first thing that we see? Disco pumpkins oh, wait. Oh, wait. and no, okay. The funny part is she like walked ahead of me and grabbed it And I didn't see what she was looking at and then I grabbed this and I was like, oh my god And then she turned around and she was also <laughs> holding the pumpkin and it's a dollar. I'm gonna get it They also have these really cute Halloween pillows. I do not need these whatsoever, but they're just cute oh, mm, The ghost pillow is five dollars. I could get it without get making it. too big of a tent I really don't I really don't need it. I really don't Listen, if I'm still thinking about this in like a week, then I'll come back. When in doubt, be nice. Those are cute. Rash. It smells like cleaning supplies. It doesn't smell good, that's for sure. Ooh, that one smells good. Hmm. We can do we can do spells with these. We can cast a spell. Can can you will you? Can yeah. You please? Remember when I said checkerboard is gonna be our generation's chevron? Mm-hmm. Oh wait. Just wait for this. I'm a victim. <laughs> I'm a victim. But I think I'm gonna be one of those Gen Z that are really old and I don't ever grow out of the chevron. And then people are gonna be like, oh my God, she's so Gen Z. The way we're like, oh my God, she's so millennial. Your checker print is my leopard print. Oh, you're so lit. Yeah. I'm hopping on the leopard print trend. I love it. Cause it can be, classy or trashy depending on how you style it and i personally can be both classy and trashy so i appreciate the versatility <laughs> Ooh. Look at me 
I said I wasn't gonna buy clothes and I really wasn't. This is five dollars and it's really basic. This is actually really cute. I'm gonna put it in the cart and if I come to my senses before checkout, I'll put it back. How is this gonna blossom? Because if I'm gonna be called unsweetened cranberry. Or should I get cran mango? That sounds really good. Tank top update. I just realized that if I had to wear a bra with it, the straps would show and that would bug the crap out of me. So it's going back. I'm so brave. What the, what the, what the <laughs> fuck that's, that's it for this vlog. I just didn't make an outro. So, peace y'all.